Hello, I'm Liam from Wellcom. I'm here today to talk to you about the iPhone 14 and 14 Pro. We've been getting a lot of questions recently about the differences between the devices, so I just thought I'd quickly break down these devices for you and what the benefits are to your business. 2022 saw the releases of four new iPhones, the iPhone 14, 14 Plus, 14 Pro and the 14 Pro Max. All four devices do have similar hardware, but between them they all have different key features. So first off, the iPhone 14. You have the iPhone 14 and 14 Plus. 14 comes in a 6.1 size and the 14 Plus comes in 6.7 green size. Perfect for those users who just want a bigger device. iPhone 14 has seen some new features being added this year, such as crash detection and satellite communication. Satellite communication should be coming soon to the UK, but it hasn't been confirmed yet. But what is the difference between the iPhone 14 and the 14 Pro? Well, the 14 Pro comes with a new feature called Dynamic Island. So sitting on the top of the screen as a notch, what this does allow you to do is interact with certain apps or certain features on the phone, such as when you're playing music, you'll be able to tap on the Dynamic Island and you'll be able to control your music. Another feature that's unique to the 14 Pro range is always on display. Your lock screen on iOS 16 will be displayed as you're always on display in the background. If you need to check your notifications, see the messages coming in, or just see if you need to crack your brolly out of your bag, always on display will give you all that information. One of the key differences in the 2022 iPhone lineup is the advanced camera that the iPhone 14 Pro range uses. Users can now shoot in 4K at 24 or 30 frames per second, which is the highest quality available in any smartphone. This makes the iPhone 14 Pro ideal for your in-house marketing team, state agents, especially with the 135 degree wide angle lens available on both phones. So as you hopefully know now, the key difference this year is a few changes in hardware and how much you actually want to spend on your next smartphone. And whilst this year's new phones are the 14 and the 14 Pro, you do have some equally good devices, such as the iPhone 13 and the iPhone SE 2022. iPhone 13 comes with a dual camera setup, just like the iPhone 14. So you have a wide angle lens on there. You also have a portrait lens on there as well. Also importantly, iPhone 13 is still compatible with iOS 16, so you still get to keep safe for the latest security updates. If you want your staff to be working within the Apple ecosystem, but don't want to spend too much on your next devices, the iPhone SE might be the device for you. With a screen size of 4.7 inches, this is a more compact contender. You still get the great 5 megapixel sensor on there for portrait photos. You still get the iOS 16 update on there as well. And more importantly, it's the first SE device to come with 5G, for like great super fast connectivity. Whether it's size, price or hardware, that is something that your business needs in your new device, the iPhone range has plenty to offer you. So if it is your time to upgrade, please contact us directly or get in touch with your account manager to discuss your options. We're more than happy to do one-on-one -on -one consultations to find the right device for you and your business.